he got into it with the girl. With the, you know what I mean? Went through a situation. I mean, if you get woe out by a white girl, what else you gonna do? You going back home? Come on, mama. You told me not to be messing with these people. You told me to leave them alone. Were you surprised to see Megan with him? No. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. When last time you have you spoken with uh, Megan Good or any any of those? Oh, that was since she's been in the land of Jonathan Majors. Mm. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a different land, man. That was crazy because a lot of people say Dang, they talk about him in a way that where they say he only came back over here because. You know, he got into it with the girl. With the, you know what I mean? Went through a situation. I mean, if you get woe out by a white girl, what else you gonna do? You going back home? Come on, mama. You told me not to be messing with these people. You told me to leave them alone. Were you surprised to see Megan with him? No. He wasn't? Really? Jonathan's a wonderful actor. Um, and, you know, and he's an incredible artist, an incredible mind. She's fascinated with minds. It's my sis, man, and she's a wonderful soul, and I thought that was a good look. I didn't know everything Jonathan was going through, you know? Uh, and for her to be rocking by her side, she's a G for that. Yeah, she did. Um, she's a G for that, and that's not for a look. Megan wouldn't do it for a look. Mm -hmm. um, and I feel for Jonathan, because um, you could see in the video, the man clearly, yeah, she got his phone. Mm -hmm. he, he, he struggled, had a struggle, get his, got his phone, and got the hell on. That nigga was running like Darkwing Duck. <laughs> nigga. He was he was out, man. I ain't never seen a nigga run that fast in some <laughs> in some All Saints boots and a, and a three quarter length. <laughs> In some skinny jeans. Yeah, he was, was like running a four four out there. No, stop it, man. <laughs> he hit that corner, pum gone. <laughs> like that was on that video. <laughs> Y'all crazy. So, so, <laughs> let me ask you this: the, the, it's a dilemma. They said if you don't put the dress on, you you, you won't get the money. Okay. As a man, all right. Break down the dress scenario. All right. In this world. All right. All right. Man, I had an opinion about this, and Marlon Wayans really made me look at it different. Mm. So there is a, there's two sides to it. Like, I think there's, I, did, I would never, I, I've modeled my career after some great leading men. If somebody brought a dress in? No. Um, no. And you would uh, never? I, would, I wouldn't. I mean, why? It's not your thing. It's not me. That's not my, that's not my, that's not my artistic choices. That's not, that's not, you know, just like people. I'm, I have no problem, you know, uh, you know, with anyone's sexuality, but I just do. I mean, I wouldn't play a gay man because um, mm -hmm. I don't know what that's it. I don't know what that is. I don't. Right. I wouldn't be able to like you know, to play a gay, to play a gay man. Look at this to play a gay man. Now, just because they say action, the, I always find reality in what I do. So I kiss a man on screen. I'm gonna go home tonight, being like, damn, I just kissed this nigga. Like now, I'm like, I'm gonna be questioning everything about me. I mean, I don't wanna have those questions. I got too many other questions going on. I'm like, man, I'm fucked around and kissed this man. What if you liked it? Exactly. Dude, <laughs> fuck your whole shit up. He calls you that night and like, like, hey, man, man. he didn't really want that. That was a great scene. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Ah oh, man, it's you know, too much, too much, man. I can't. Okay, so, so those are things that you know. I mean, you know, that's just not me. But, but the dress thing, Marlon made a great point. Marlon said, you know, nobody said nothing when Robin Williams played Mrs. Daffire exactly. and he yeah. murdered that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, Tootsie. Yeah, with, with, yeah. with uh, 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 my man. So, you know, uh, uh, I don't know. I just know for me personally, that's just my. Thing, um, but Marlon, it was genius. They were genius as white girls, but that was their choice. Hollywood didn't tell them to do that. That's them being funny, and that's where that that's their range of comedic um, expression. They they'll go all the way. They don't care. Um, I just don't feel. I don't feel like I need to put on no dress. I don't have to. I, I, I'm a I'm a man. I'm a leading man. For sure. And, um, and I want to play multiple strong leading men. Um, and and there's the other part of that. I feel like. There is a silent agenda to demasculate, mm -hmm. to demasculate, demasculate the African American male. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And and the more I see it, the more I, I kind of want to hold my ground. The day you see Denzel in dress, call me back on Boss Talk. Wow, ain't happening. That's never gonna happen. It ain't or happening. even Samuel L. Jackson. The day you see Samuel in dress, put me, call me back happen. on Boss Talk. It's not gonna happen. Mm -hmm. So how did you like? You Drake had a, uh, his album the last one. I know you listen to music a lot. Yeah. You're a musician. Yeah. How did you like Drake's uh, last project? It was cool. 
It's cool. <laughs> I'm, wait, I'm waiting for Usher to drop. Usher's going to drop, yeah, too. I, I heard, I've heard. i heard a few that y'all ain't heard. His mm. stuff, it'll be crazy. Mm. Man, this music, how, how do you feel music, the music industry is doing right now? It's kind of, man, the Grammys, Let's be real. The Grammys was kind of you seen that they arrested Killer Mike. Killer Mike. Oh, you know they arrested. What was that about? They I said he Killer got Mike. his well, awards. You know, you know what Killer the hell Mike. What was that about? Because Killer Mike is hot on that mic, and when he he could have said anything about Biden, he could have affected the culture. They don't want him up there. He, he, he don't have him on that mic. Whatever. Because <laughs> arrest that nigga. Uh, for nothing. Get him. Yeah. Get the nigga yeah, out yeah, of here. Yeah, yeah. Put him. Put, lock him up. Uh, but I think the music like R and B, rap. Um, the, 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 the Killer Mike had a con- to, uh, album with content. It killed. It was, it was good, man. Oh, that whole, man. That whole was solid. It was yeah, hitting some, high, so He was hitting ooh, everything. He was hitting cylinders. He yeah, always do yeah, that. So this I, ain't so, his first time no, doing no, that, bro. So that's why, you know, I've been working diligently. My album is dropping in April. It's finally oh, done. Wow. And bringing real music back. Yeah. Um, uh, music science. Can't that's wait why, to hear it. Yeah, I'm excited for it. You know, I, I'm, y'all going to get an exclusive. You're you gonna come and let me just you know we're gonna vibe. We're gonna vibe. We're gonna talk it. through the album. I know that's what I know it's do. gonna have a lot of instruments in it. It's going to. It's going. You ain't to. gonna play with it. No, it's, we ain't played with it. We. It's taken me a long, I don't time. Know, a long time. I have over like 500 records recorded, cut. Um, How many we, songs are you giving us? Um, I'm gonna do a hot eight, but the interludes. It's gonna be a a, a musical journey, a story. It's called Headlines. So okay. it's taking you from everything from the fall from scandal to where we are now, and just d- through through song and interlude stories. But it's gonna be a, a piece of music science, and wow. that's what the academy judges you on. You know, so, I, I I I'm I'm upset with the music because you know I'm a four five minute. You know, song type nigga. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Back when Prince was having, back when Prince was I'm a having four, that. Five, I like for the four five songs. You hear me? I like yeah. the song to go. Listen, man, five. <laughs> I'm in that whole vibe, and it was once. Len- Lenny, it yeah. went forever. It went forever. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, oh, and I cry. <laughs> Girl, you know I, I, I love you. <laughs> I cry. We going for five, six minutes. Five, six minutes. They don't do that no, no, no more. It's no. two minutes. I mean, <laughs> but it was, it's kind of no, no, no shade to scissor. I mean, the number one that, that to be that big of a record about a double homicide. Yeah. Crazy, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, this is the state. I mean, we got to start. So, I just, am I wrong for thinking? No, like you're that? not wrong for it. And we love music, but then. you know what did our parents say to y'all when you start listening to what you listen to? Now? Oh, they thought we were crazy. Yeah, I took my. I always say I took my mom from uh, Marvin Gaye. To- too short. <laughs> to all you bitches, hoes, and all that shit. Here's another rap. <laughs> Shit's messed up, bro. That's messed up. Right. Too right. short and Luke. Oh, 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 oh. Right. Listen up, y'all, cause this is it. Forget that old dance and Right. I'm gonna throw that D. <laughs> That's what the song said. I got it playing. Hey, you don't give a shit. All you wanna do is throw that dick. 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 Thro